What is up guys, welcome back to the channel. Today we take a look at 10 facts you didn't know about Albert Einstein. Be sure to like today's video and to subscribe. Also comment down below letting me know that you subscribed so that you can automatically be entered into this month's shout out giveaway. Coming in at number one, we have German citizenship. If you didn't know already, Albert Einstein was of German descent and when he was 16 years old, he actually renounced his German citizenship and was actually stateless until he became a Swiss citizen in 1901. Coming in at number two, we have marriage. Melvia Merrick was the only female in Albert Einstein's physics class at Zurich Polytechnic. Melvia was passionate about math and science and an inspiring physicist. However, she left all the physics to Einstein when the two got married and had kids because she decided to stay home and take care of the kids. Coming in at number three, we have the FBI file. Probably one of the most shocking things on this list that you probably didn't know was that Albert Einstein actually had a 1,427 page FBI file on him. The file consisted of all associations with different groups and organizations that Albert Einstein had. J. Edgar Hoover even tried to ban Albert Einstein from America but was later overruled by the U.S. State Department. Coming in at number four, we have he had an illegitimate baby. Einstein and Melivia gave birth to a little girl in 1902, in which the couple named the baby Lizriel. However, what exactly happened to the baby is still a mystery. There is some speculation that the baby was given up for adoption but others speculate that the baby actually died from scarlet fever in her infancy. Coming in at number five, we have divorce. After not being married that long, Einstein decided to give his entire Nobel Prize money to his wife, Melivia, for a divorce. The amount added up to be $32,350, which is more than 10 times the annual salary of an average professor at the time. Coming in at number six, Einstein was inbred. After divorcing his first wife, Einstein married another lady by the name of Elsa. Elsa was Einstein's first cousin through both of Einstein's parents. And if you're a little confused, then that means that Einstein's dad was brothers with Elsa's dad and Einstein's mother was sisters with Elsa's mother. Coming in at number seven, we have civil rights. Albert Einstein was a strong supporter of civil rights and free speech before the civil rights movement even took place. In 1951, when W.E.B. Dubias was indicted as an unregistered agent for a foreign power, Einstein volunteered to testify on his behalf as a witness. Coming in at number 8, we have Insane. Albert's second son, Edward, was diagnosed with schizophrenia and even became institutionalized for most of his adult life. After Albert Einstein immigrated to the United States, in 1933, his son Edward died in a psychiatric clinic at the age of 55. Coming in at number 9, we have Chemical Warfare. A man named Fritz Harber, who was a German chemist, recruited Einstein in Berlin as part of his crew. After some time, the two became close friends However, it wasn't long after that, Fritz Harbour came developed a deadly chlorine gas that was meant to be used in war. The chlorine gas was to be thrown in bunkers that contained soldiers, in which it would burn their throats and lungs severely. Which leaves people to speculate if Einstein took part in the development and start of chemical warfare. Coming in at number 10, we have Russian Spy. In 1935, Einstein's stepdaughter, Margaret, introduced him to a lady by the name of 
Megaritis Konnikova. The two fell in love and began writing love letters to each other and seeing each other occasionally. However, according to a book written by a Russian spy master at the time, Konnikova was actually a Russian agent, though historians have not confirmed this claim.